German financial giant Deutsche Bank could see its CEO being sacked within weeks amid rising tensions between him and the bank's chairman, a move that could destabilize Angela Merkel's already fragile government. The position of John Cryan, the bank's British chief executive, looks threatened by his rivalry with the bank's Austrian chairman Paul Ackleitner. A senior source told the Financial Times Mr. Cryan may be fired before the bank's annual meeting taking place on 24 May, as the company has already started looking for a new chief, the source said, there is no way he will make it to the AGM. Mr. Cryan arrived in 2015 amid hopes he would have been able to give the German lender a fresh start following years of lackluster return, legal cases and a battered share price, but the bank's poor performance recorded lately, together with Mr. Cryan's rumoured lack of leadership, could be the main reason that brought to the crisis. In the last few months Deutsch has reported annual losses, suffered further declines in investment banking revenue and dropped its 2018 cost-cutting target. A person familiar with the chairman's thinking told the Financial Times, it just appears as if John is lacking the resolve to put the strategy into practice. The source added that the supervisory board is really puzzled about what has been going on with him. Sources in Frankfurt also argued that sacking the Briton could be Mr. Ackleitner's attempt to safeguard his own position. Although the lender's two leading people have reportedly never had an easy relationship, the rift seems to have become wider last year. The chairman and the CEO reportedly have different views even on the future of the bank. While Mr. Cryan wants to undertake deeper cut in the investment banking division, Mr. Ackleitner would prefer to avoid them. A boardroom insider told the Financial Times, Mr. Cryan and Mr. Ackleitner just need to make a decision on the investment bank strategy, that is what is behind all this. This instability is likely to make the bank even more unstable, which could mean trouble for German Chancellor Angela Merkel. In 2016 the Chancellor said she would not put state money into the bank in a bid to save it, yet, a collapse of one of the most important banks in Europe could bring Ms Merkel's fragile coalition to an end, but a state rescue could destabilize the euro, which could threaten Ms Merkel's leading position in the EU. Deutsche Bank is so at risk of a default that its situation has been compared to the one of the banks of less rich EU state members. Holger Schorpitz, a financial editor and expert on debt, said the bank's default risk was now the highest in the continent as the former powerhouse struggled from one crisis to the next. He said the credit risk at Germany's biggest lender was now even worse than Italy's cash-strapped Unicredit Bank.